she's still there? She wants her money for what? For the chicken sandwich I dropped freshly for her. And I made another one for her. And then she's like, nope, it's the same thing. I don't want this. I want nuggets. So I went to go get the nuggets. And then she's like, what's your name? I was like, what's the problem? What do you want? And she was like, you know what? I don't like your attitude. I just want my money back. So why don't you just give her her money back? We just dropped everything. Plus, we have other customers behind that just left. That's a waste of our food. Well, everything fresh for her. It solves your attitude. problem, right? chicken sandwich special for her. Well, first they gave her a chicken sandwich. She said, this is cold, gave it back. So they made another chicken sandwich. She gave it back to her. She said, this is the same thing. I don't want it. Give me some chicken nuggets. And then she said she wants her money back, but they won't give her money back because they said that they already did the drop. But there's a drawer sitting on the counter full of money. Can you just give this lady your money back so she get the hell out of your drive through You saying can you give her her money? What, how, what, how much money are we talking about here? She wanted her whole meal back. And I'm not refunding the whole meal, which I dropped freshly for her and everything. And then I did two things for her. And then she wants to be rude and belligerent. And then she's video cameraing me. Okay. And I'm like, so that's illegal. You can't do that. I'm sorry. What do you want? She was like, I just want my money back. I was like... I just gave you your stuff freshly. Now you want your money back? I was like, I dropped those things. We're wasting our food, our money. And she wants to be rude. I'm like, well, just pull over. And she's like, no, give my money back now. And then she has her video camera. And I was like, you know what? If you don't leave my drive through I'm going to call the cops. Okay. Well, and it's a car. civil matter. She hasn't stolen anything. Uh, she hasn't done anything. She just wants her money back. You're not giving her her money back. So, therefore, she's sitting in the driveway. She, has she so taken? I told I told her to just give her her money, and she was like, "Well, I want two refunds." Now. I'm like, "Well, she gets like, okay, she gets well, her. You can give her her like, money okay, back for what she gave you." Stuff. And then she's like, "I want this and this." I was like, "I actually made a mistake, and I gave her her stuff." I mean, you got a spider on you. Watch out! Look, look, look that way. It's like I tried to help her out, trying to do stuff fresh for her, and she wants to be rude. I had two customers behind her that just left. Now I had to throw those away. I was like, pull well, over. Well, see, it makes, more, it makes more sense to me that you give her money back so she can get out of the way, and then you can have customers get through. Because you see, if she continues to sit there, you're going to lose more customers. How much money are we talking about? What was the total amount of the product that she returned? Right now, she just returned the nuggets, and that's it. Okay, so she, so she returned two items. A sandwich and something else. The she sandwich said, that she wanted refunded. The sandwich she wanted because it was too dark. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, well, we'll make a fresh one. So mm -hmm. I gave her a fresh one. She's like, I don't want it. I want nuggets. So what can we do to refund her? Because, I, was I like, mean, I, this would solve a lot of problems if we could just give her money and she'd be on her way. She wanted her chicken sandwich and wedges. So I told her just to do it. And then, can we do that? And I will tell her that?
has decided that she is going to refund your money. Okay, so she'll be out here, or well, we'll have your money in just a second. She called you guys, thinking she that did. I was going to leave and be scared and run for the police. There's no reason because I know that I wasn't wrong after the refund of food that was burned. Like, Absolutely. Absolutely. And that's the even waste of time to come out here. She was just, she was, She know. paid for it on card. She wouldn't refund it to the card. Oh. Well, she was just being nothing but a problem. Oh, yeah. You can tell like her man was She up the world. All right, guys. I'm sorry about that. Yeah. He's got to just write down that case number so you can... Because they need to do something to make this right. Because that's ridiculous. and then I will go in and talk to them. I asked her to move out to the side. I'm going to go inside and talk to them. No, Burton's already talking to them. Oh, okay. The way for him to come out and tell you what's up. Okay. Just stay in the car, and I'll come and talk to you. Thank you. Excuse me, 
was just sitting there with her. Did she, has so she I told, I told her to just give her her money. And she was like, well, I want two refunds now. I'm like, well, she, she gets, said, okay, she gets well. Her, you can give her like, her money okay, back or what she our needed. Food stuff. And then she's like, I want this and this. I was like, I actually made a mistake and I gave her her stuff. I mean. You got the spider on you. <laughs> I tried to help her out. I'm just trying to do stuff French for her and she wants to be her. I had two customers behind her that just left. Now I have to throw those away. I was like, pull over. Well, see, it makes, more, it makes it. more sense to me that you give her money back so she can get out of the way and then you can have customers come through. Because you see, if she continues to sit there, you're going to lose more customers. How much money are we talking about? What was the total amount of the product that she returned? Right now, she just returned the nuggets and that's it. No, okay, she so said she returned two items. A sandwich wanted, and something else. The she sandwich said, that she wanted refunded. The sandwich she wanted because it was too dark. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, well, we'll make a fresh one. So mm -hmm. I gave her a fresh one. She's like, I don't want it. I want nuggets. So what can we do to refund her money? Because, I, was I like, mean, I, this would solve a lot of problems if we could just give her money and she'd be on her way. She wanted her chicken sandwich and wedges. So I told her just to do it. Okay. Then, Can we do that? And I will tell her that. Hope you have a better night tonight. All right, as soon as I it was get about home, the wedges and the sandwich, right? Yes, and that's yeah. all it was. Yeah, that's so all I you wanted to Nothing yeah. else. I had a whole bunch of other food that I just spent bought, spent money with them. Mm -hmm. I just spent twenty dollars separately and said my order was wrong. Mm -hmm. And she said no, no refund. Okay. All right. Hope well, you have a good you. night. All right, thank, thank you very you. much. Come on. What? 
It's already on the call. Make your safe approach from that. Can you approach from that side? Yeah. Hi. They've been disrespectful. They won't give us our money back. Oh, I have been sitting here asking for a refund of my And we would have been going. First, it all started when she kept letting me know when I was trying to work. I got kids in the car. I come around and walk over the truck. I come back. She knows that we're going to let her on about it. Okay. Then when I got the sandwich, the sandwich was like, okay, the sandwich was going to make another sandwich. She was like, whatever. I asked her what her name was. She was like, okay, I did step a picture of the inside of the store and I step a picture of her because she wasn't your name. And then all I asked her was to give me my green flag for my sandwich and my potato wedges. And she said she asked me to do my And that's why this whole thing, I think it's all the time she refused to do my green Which, what's she saying? She said that she came in and made her chicken sandwich special. Well, the first I gave her a chicken sandwich, she said this is what we gave it back. And then I made another chicken sandwich, she gave it back, and she said this is the same thing, I don't want it. Give me some chicken nuggets. And then she said she wants her money back, and they won't give her money back because they said that they already did the drop, but they didn't know her sitting on the counter with the money. Can you go ask him if they can make an exception and give this refund? We're not acting like you're a criminal. No, that's good. No, Burton's already talking to them. So wait for him to come out and tell you what's up. Just stay in the car, and I'll come and talk to you. Thank you. Make sure you just go check on them. I'll say hi, everybody. That's ridiculous. All I wanted was a refund. And she refused me to give me my refund. I gave her the food back. She wanted to record me. I recorded her. She didn't want to give me her name or nothing. Like, if somebody's asking you a manager, and then as soon as I asked her name, she was like, what's the problem? What's the problem? Like, well, I just want to know your name because you were rude as yeah. soon as we came up. And she just refused. Then she took the food back and was like, she wouldn't give me the food. Then she was like, and I was like, I just want a refund. Then I can go. Yeah. But her and her friends were sitting there laughing with the door closed and pointing and all that. Well, they're in there right now. Uh, the officers are trying to. All come to an agreement trying to get her to give you a refund. For those two items, and I could have been gone. I just came from a, a thing for my goddaughter that got murdered yeah. like two years ago. I'm sorry ago. to hear that. Um, right. Well, here, we're, we're going to give you a case number uh, just because we came out here. And so, I mean, I would recommend bringing it up the chain uh, of Jack in the Box. Because and, that's ridiculous. And like, that way you can have a case number that shows that the police I, were out here for something so trivial where they could have just refunded it. she could have just refunded me I, like five I hours. understand. I, yeah, that's it's crazy. I've never heard of anything like this before. <sighs> sure, here's my card. Here's my ID. Yeah, they're trying to work it out right now inside because it sounds like they're being a... They, obviously, even they are the, being ridiculous. Even the girl with the red shirt was agreeing with me because she was like, she was trying to whisper to me. She was even agreeing with me. And, and how, she what's, working in there with you. How much do they owe you? Like $5 and some change. All she okay. had to do was put it back on my card. All right. I think they're, she's trying to work and it out or something. she just didn't want it. What's up? She has 
decided that she is going to refund your money. There we go. Okay, so she'll be out here, or well, we'll have your money in just a second. She called you guys, thinking she that did. I was going to leave and be scared and run from the police. There's no reason, because I know that I wasn't wrong asking for a refund of uh, food that was burnt. Like, absolutely, absolutely. And that's if you even wasting time to come out here. I told her that you were going to give her a business card with a case number on it so she can make a complaint to Jack in the Box about the way it was handled. But you can go give her money first. That's kind of ridiculous, man. Well, she was just, she was, a she paid for it on card. She wouldn't refund it to the card. Oh. Well, she was just being nothing but a problem. Oh, yeah. You could tell just her manners in there. She said it the world. All right, guys. I'm sorry about that. All right, thank you. Yeah. Wow. And he's going to just write down that case number so you can make a complaint. Because they need to do something to make this right. Because that's ridiculous. I mean, like, all you had to do is give me my refund. I would have been gone. Yeah. I've literally been here for, like, 30 minutes. And everybody behind me was going at me. Yeah. No, I agree. All right, guys. Yeah, well, have a yeah. yeah. Hey, no, don't apologize to us. I mean, you guys were just trying to get your money. That's, that's yeah. Like I said, they need to make this right. So, yeah. Yep.